I think I'm having an overdose of so is my wife. Overdose of what? Marijuana. I don't know if it had something in it. Can you please send rescue? Do you guys have fever or anything? No, I'm just, I think we're dying. Okay, how much did you guys have? I, I don't know. We made brownies, and I think we're dead. Time is going by really, 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 really slow. Yeah, I'm over here. I'm over here at Burger King right here in San Clemente. Mm-hmm. Um, no, not San Clemente. I'm sorry. Um, I live in San Clemente. I'm in Laguna Niguel, I think. That's where I'm at. Uh-huh. I'm at a drive through right now. Uh-huh. I, had, I ordered my food three times. They're mopping the floor inside, and I understand they're busy. They're not even busy. Okay, I've been the only car here. I asked them four different times to make me a Western barbecue burger. Okay, they keep giving me a hamburger with lettuce, tomato, and cheese, onions. And I said, I'm not leaving. Uh-huh. I want a Western burger because I just got my kids from Taekwondo. They're hungry. I'm on my way home, and I live in San Clemente. Uh-huh. Okay, she, said, she gave me another hamburger. It's wrong. I said four times. I said, I want it. She goes, can you go out and park in front? I said, no. I want my hamburger right. So then the, the lady came to the manager, she, or whatever, whoever she is, she came up and she said, um, she said, um, do you want your money back? And I said, no, I want my hamburger. My kids are hungry, and I have to jump on the toll freeway. I said, I am not leaving this spot. Uh, and I said, I will call the police because I want my Western burger done right. Now, is that so hard? Okay, what exactly is it you want us to do for you? I send the officer down here. I want, I want them to make me Bert, the right. Ma'am, we're not going to go down there and enforce your Western bacon cheeseburger. And, 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 ma'am, then I suggest you get your money back and go somewhere else. This, 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 is, this is not a criminal issue. We can't go out there and, and make them make you a cheeseburger the way you want it. Well, that is, that, you're supposed to be here to protect me. Well, what are we protecting you from, a wrong cheeseburger? No. Is, is this, this a, like, is this a harmful cheeseburger or something? I don't understand what you want us to do. Almost there to the emergency. Hi. Um, I'm at the corner of Pleasant Hill and John Young Parkway. I'm in a Walgreens parking lot. And my car will not start. I'm locked inside my car. I cannot open my car. I can't get the windows down. Nothing electrical works. And it's, it's getting very hot in here, and, I, and I'm, I'm not feeling well. I, I need some help. Just, just, are you able to pull the lock up on the door and open the door? You should be able to just pull the lock up, even if it's electrical. I tried. Oh, okay, okay. All right, I got that going. Okay. So are you able to get out the car now? Yes, I got the door open. Okay. All righty. Uh, I'll, I'll see if I can get AAA or something. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm I'm sorry. That's okay. All righty. Bye bye. I just broke into a house, and the owner came home. You you broke into a house? Yeah. Where at? I don't know. Okay, so are you still there? Yeah. Okay, so are you... I I think that guns. I'm sorry. My name is Timothy Chappick. I... I broke in. I was kidnapped. I've already, I've already called him. Sheriff's Department, how can I help you? Yeah, I'm over here. I'm over here at Burger King, right here in San Clemente. Mm-hmm. Um, no, not San Clemente. I'm sorry. Um, I live in San Clemente. I'm in Laguna Niguel, I think. That's where I'm at. Uh-huh. I'm at a drive-through right now. Uh-huh. I had, I ordered my food three times. They're mopping the floor inside, and I understand they're busy. They're not even busy. Okay, I've been the only car here. I asked them four different times to make me a Western barbecue burger. Okay. They keep giving me a hamburger with lettuce, tomato, and cheese, onions. And I said, I'm not leaving. Uh-huh. I want a Western burger because I just got my kids from Taekwondo. They're hungry. I'm on my way home, and I live in San Clemente. Uh-huh. Okay. She, said, she gave me another hamburger. It's wrong. I said four times. I said, I want it. She goes, can you go out and park in front? I said, no. I want my hamburger right. So then the, the lady came to the manager, she, or whatever, whoever she is. She came up, and she said, um, she said, um, do you want your money back? And I said, no, I want my hamburger. My kids are hungry, and I have to jump on the toll freeway. I said, I am not leaving this spot. Uh, and I said, I will call the police because I want my Western burger done right. Now, is that so hard? Okay, what exactly is it you want us to do for you? I send the officer down here. I want, I want them to make me Bert, the right. Ma'am, we're not going to go down there and enforce your Western bacon cheeseburger. What am I supposed to do? This is, this is between you and the manager. This, we're not going to go enforce how to make a hamburger. That's, well, not, that's not a criminal issue. 
There's, there's, there's nothing criminal. So I just there. stand here. So I just sit here. And you block. you need to calmly and rationally speak to the manager and figure out what to do between you. She did come up and I said, "Can I please have my Western burger?" She she said, "I'm not dealing with." She walked away Cause, because they're mopping the floor and it's all full of suds and they don't want to run. They don't want to go through there and and, and ma'am, then I suggest you get your money back and go somewhere else. This 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 is this is not a criminal issue. We can't go out there and and make them make you a cheeseburger the way you want it. Well, that is that you're supposed to be here to protect me. Well, what are we protecting you from? A wrong cheeseburger? No. Is, is this, this like is this a harmful cheeseburger or something? I don't understand what you want us to do. Well, just come down here. I'm, I'm not leaving. No, ma'am, I'm not sending the deputies down there over a cheeseburger. You need to go in there and act like an adult and either get your I money back and go home. I not acting like an adult herself. I'm sitting here in my car. I just want them to make my kid a, a, a Western burger. Now, this is what I suggest. I suggest you get your money back from the manager and you go on your way home. Okay. Okay? okay. Bye-bye. Oh. What is your emergency? Uh, I need help. And what's the problem? I'm too high. You're too high? Yeah. What what do you take? I can't feel anything. Your what? I can't feel anything. Okay, what did you take? Weed. Weed? Yes. yes. Okay. What's your name? Is there anyone there with you? Yeah, they don't know. Okay, how old are you? Twenty two. Are they gonna be able to answer the door for us? Yeah. Okay, Andrew, we'll send an email right over to check you out, okay? Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Mm, 911, what's the location of your emergency? Uh, let's not get into that yet. I have a question. Is this an emergency, sir? Depends. Well, no, not really. If it's not an emergency, you don't call 911, sir. Well, I have a, qu a legal question. Well, it's not a, is, is this an emergency? I don't know what that means. Is it life-threatening or an act of crime in progress? Crime in progress, possibly. What's going on? I was just growing some marijuana. I was just wondering what the, how much, you know, trouble you can get into for one plant. You're growing marijuana and you want to know how much, depends on how big the plant is. It's only a seedling. No, it's possession. Okay. You can get pinched for a roach in a car. Okay. All right. Thanks for the info. You're welcome. Goodbye. The item's been out. What's the matter? With my mouth. Was your mouth? No, it's my mouth. I have to do it. Will you help me? Sure. Where do you live? No, it's my mask. Yeah, I know it. Where do you live, though? No, I want you to talk to me on the phone. No, I can't do that. I can send someone else to help you. Okay, um... What kind of mask do you have that you need help with? I have, I have takeaways. Oh, you got to do the takeaways? Yeah. All right, what's the problem? Um, you have to help me with my mask. Okay, tell me what the mask is. Okay, 16. Yeah. Take away 8. Uh huh. Is what? You tell me, how much do you think it is? I don't know, 1. No. How old are you? I'm only 4. 4? Yeah. Yeah. What's another problem? That was a tough one. Um. Oh, here's one. 5, take away 5. Five, take away five. And how much do you think that is? Five. Johnny, what are you doing? You're playing the man's office. He was saying, yeah. What did I tell you about playing on the bed? That's a word, mother. You didn't make me help. The car sounds bad. I didn't mean to play. Objective Anonymous Williams. I got a situation over here with a subway. Uh, okay, so what's going on there? Well, I ordered two sandwiches, and I asked for everything on one sandwich, and the other one I asked for certain things on the other sandwich. I didn't get 
what I paid for. I'm on the phone with you. The, 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 the employee just came up here and locked the freaking door. And I got both of the sandwiches. They did not make right for me. And so I just called 15 minutes ago, okay? So you just find to be a little patient. Um, I was at a McDonald's. I paid $10. And these guys gave me one burger and a fry and told me to pull around. Okay, I sir. That's a, this yeah. is not a 911 emergency. Let me get... Sir, this is not a police matter. You need to take it up with the manager of the McDonald's. I'm going to disconnect. I got robbed for my money. Sir, you did not get robbed. I'm going to disconnect with you now. I was at McDonald's. I gave these guys $10. They gave me one burger and a fry and told me to park. Sir, I believe you just talked to my partner a moment ago, and he advised you this is not a 911 emergency. This is a 911 emergency. I got robbed for $8. You cannot tell me I can call 911 and not get a cop right here. Sir. You can tell me I can't get a cop right here at 82nd and Sunnyside Road. I will see your office right now. The 12 year old is completely out of control, and I, I can't, I physically, if she's as big as I am, I can't control her. Okay, did you want us to come over to shoot her? Are you there? Excuse me? Uh, that's a joke. Okay, so. Who that's are you? What is your name? Mike Forbes. Okay, that's not funny, Mike. I'm and sorry. What, I'm going to file a formal complaint. That, get... I don't blame you a bit. You've called three times. What do you need? I called you back. You don't answer. What is your emergency? What can the police department help you with at this very moment? What do you need? I, I don't answer because my telephone is off. Okay, well, it's not off because you keep dialing 911 and not answering. You hang up and you don't, you don't, you're not there. What do you need us to do for you right now? I have an emergency call on the other line. You need to get a husband. You need to get a husband. Yeah. You're calling yeah. 911 to get a husband. Well, that, my is, that is not, that doesn't, yes, you know you can get arrested for dialing 911? Do you know do you, know you can get arrested for dialing 911? Let's do it. You want to get arrested for dialing 911? Absolutely. Okay. You stay on the line, okay? Thank you, dear. All right. Audrey? Okay, we're going to send you an officer, okay? Thank you. So You're much. welcome. Bye-bye. 911, do you need police, fire, and ambulance? Police. Where? Okay, it's the McDonald's on um, Delaware. What's going on there? I ordered a um, 10 piece chicken nugget with a small fry. And mm -hmm. she said that they didn't have any chicken nuggets. And so I told her I want a um, McDonald's with a small fry. And she told me I would have to pick anything else off the menu because she can't refund me um, the different things out of the meal. And I told her, well, just give me all my money back. And she said, well, she can't give me my money back either. She will have to, I have to pick something. There's no manager there? Ma'am. You already spoke with the manager? She says she are the manager. She's saying something about she just can't refund me my money or something. But she don't have on a meal when I want it. And so she didn't have that. So I told her to give me a McDouble and just to find a gift. She can't do that. So I told her to just give me all my money back. And I don't want anything. Um, and she's telling me she can't refund my money in the house. She don't have what I want. And she can't force me to eat something that I don't want. Do. I tell the lady I want the lemonade, fresh lemonade. She say, you, uh, you, I don't have, we don't have a lemonade. I say, why you didn't say that to me before? She's going to let me make me stay here for 15 minutes. That's what she says. Okay, this way she gives me the food. That's okay, and the food's not done, sir. The food's not done. The food is done. The food is done. She says she's going to make me stay here for 15 minutes because I'm talking too much with her. Not that because you're unhappy with your burger, okay? Have you given them any money? No. No? Have they given you any food? No. No? Okay, then you can drive away, sir. If I'm hungry, what is, why she say she's not going to give me the food? Sir, before come on. This, before this come on. Minutes. Come on. I know you don't seriously think that the police need to make Burger King give you food faster. What do you need medical for? Um, actually, um, what the no problem lab. is, um, I took some pills, and um, actually, um, I took um, two um, Viagra um, pills, and um, my erection been up for like four days, and there hasn't been any signs of change whatsoever, and I'm really sick. 911, do you need fire, medical, or police? No, ma'am, I don't. I don't have an emergency. Two police officers just left my house just now. Third. Can we get their names, please? Oh, I'd like that, yeah. Why do you need them to come back there? Um, because I have an emergency. I'll, th I'll think of something. Honey, I'm just going to be honest with you, okay? I just thought he was cute. I'm 45 years old, and I'd like to meet him again. But I don't know how to go about doing that without calling 911. 
I know this is not absolutely in a way, shape, or form an emergency. This is 911. I need, uh, I need, uh, a ride. You need a ride? Yes, it's a liquor store. Um. Sure, so she gave me a ride. Okay, you, you're going to have to call somebody else, sir. You called 911. We can't come give you a ride. Even the sheriff says she can give me a ride now. The sheriff said they give you a ride to the liquor store? That's correct. Wrong. Fire rescue? Yes, 38. Okay, what's the address that we need to come to? Pardon me? Your address, sir? 4220 Winfrey, baby. Texas Avenue and Rio Grande. I'm sorry, it's 4220 4220 Winford? 4220. 4220, 4220 Winford, sir? Yes. Okay, and what's going on there? That shit happened yesterday, and you motherfuckers trying to put my ass in jail. And okay. not understanding what's going on. Okay, do you need medical attention? Yes. What, what is wrong? I don't know. I ain't no goddamn doctor. Okay, sir, I'm trying to help you. Well, um, help me send me some out here. What the hell? What's the hold up? Sir, what it, are you feeling pain? What is the problem? I'm crazy as hell. Uh, so do you need us? I don't know what I need. Sheriff's office, not. are you on the line? Yes, we are. Do you need us to go with you? He said uh, somebody hit him. He is hurt. I ain't had my goddamn medicine this morning. I ain't got no medicine. I went to the fucking hospital, and the doctor got mad because I told him that... Uh, White boy, you should fuck my mama a long time ago. Sir, are you in pain somewhere, or what is it? Yes, I got headaches in my leg and everything. I've been in a fucking fight. So you need, you want the paramedics to come and check you, correct? Well, I thought you were getting. What the hell going on? Sir, you need to calm down and talk to me. I am trying to help you, and I'm trying to send the paramedics, but I need to understand what the problem is. I don't know what the problem is. Okay, but you're feeling head pain. Is that correct? I've been, yes, I've been injured. I've been hit on the head and everything else. How else do a motherfucker be a All right, when, when when did that happen? Yesterday. Damn. My head's hurting. You gonna send somebody out here or you gonna fuck around on the phone? Sir, I have no problem sending you help, okay? The paramedics will come and they'll check you. How old are you? I'm 62 years old. I retired from Diamond Chrysler. Okay, and are you in old. Millennium Point Apartments? Yes. What I apartment mean, number are you in? What's going on down there, ma'am? Sir, I am trying to help you. What apartment number are you in? What, but shit, my head is hurting. You tell Can me you tell, tell me, me what apartment number my... you're in? What? What apartment number are you in? I ain't no goddamn apartment. It's are you in Millennium like Point Apartments? Motherfucker, what's wrong with your ass? How much schooling have you had? Sir, are you in Millennium Point Apartments? I told you that. Okay, what, what apartment number are Denver? you in? What apartment number are you in? I ain't no goddamn apartment. It's a town house. Okay, and what kind of medical history do you have, sir? I don't know. Let them check it out. I ain't no fucking doctor. I ain't no nurse either. Okay. You use that as yes, you want to know. That's how it's been since you What's before. your name? I'm Reverend Lowdown. And what's the phone number that you're calling from? I don't know what it is. I, I gave you the goddamn address. That's enough. Are you? Is your phone number 407-883-5636? Well, you know the fucking number. Why you ask me? Because I need to confirm it with you, sir. All right. You got it. Do you not have an apartment number? I ain't got no goddamn... I don't live in no goddamn apartment. I live in a townhouse, motherfucker. Okay. S.O.? Yeah, we still here. Uh, sir, do you have a townhouse number? 4220, motherfucker. That's okay. What you keep saying. Uh, so we Wait. definitely need you to go with us. We're on our way. Okay. I'll let them know. Sir, stay on the phone with the sheriff's office, okay? Do you need to talk to him, S.O.? I'm going to try. Okay. Thank you. Sir? Hello? Yes. The guy that hit you, is he still there? Hell yeah, yeah, he live over here, right? Probably run a dope house right next door to me. He white, black, or Hispanic? I don't know what color he is. You call him what you want to call him. What does he look to you? Why? I don't know. He looks like one of Jesus' children. He looks like what? 
One of Jesus' children. Okay, what's his skin color? I don't know. Okay. I don't see no color. Do you know what color clothes he's wearing? I don't know. The motherfucker in the house. Okay, so we have somebody come to you, okay? All right. Goodbye. All right. Clark County 911. Somebody's really drunk driving down Granton Road. Okay, we're on Grant Road. Uh, there's only like six mile drive through Granton and Neilsville and Which way are they going? They are going, um Towards Granton or towards Neilsville? Towards Granton. Okay, are you behind them or No, I am them. You am them? Yes, I am them. Okay, so you wanna call and report that you're driving drunk? Yes. Okay, what's your name? Mary. Are you still driving right now? Yes. Do you want to stop driving before you get in an accident? Yes, I will stop. Okay, you going to stop right now? Yep, I will stop right now. Okay, I'm stopping. Okay, just hang on the phone, okay? What kind of vehicle do you have, Mary? I have a Saturn. Can I take my seatbelt off? I'm sorry, what was that? Can I take my seatbelt off? If you're stopped. If I'm stopped. If you're stopped, that's fine, yeah. I don't have the car turned off, though. What's that? I don't have the car turned off. I guess... And if, I'm in park. Okay. Can I take my seatbelt off? Yeah, as long as you're not driving, as long as you're not moving. Can I turn my car off and turn, turn the flashers on? Yeah, that, yep, that's fine. If you want to turn it off and turn the flashers on, so then we can find you. Where are you coming from, Mary? I came from the Oldsville. I'm coming from... Here. Neilsville to Granton on Grant Road. And you were drinking in Neilsville? I was drinking all over. I'm sorry. I shouldn't be driving. How many people do you get that call in on themselves? Not many. <laughs> but I guess it's better than getting in an accident and killing yourself or somebody else. No, I don't want to hurt anybody. I'm drunk. Am I going to go to jail? What's that? Do I go to jail? I guess if you're over the legal limit, I mean... Well, I know I am. Can I walk in there? No. So I need to puff as many as I can, right? <laughs> I guess, yeah, if you want to. This really sucks. I'm sitting here calling on myself, but I don't want to hurt anybody. Right. Can I get out of my car? What's that? Can I get out of my, get out of my car? Uh, why don't you just stay there, because they're, they're going to be coming, and I don't want them to not see you. I have my flashers on. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, there go the flashers. They're here. Okay, I will let you go and speak with them. Okay, thank you. Yep, bye. Bye. 911, what's your emergency? I need assistance at Jim's, uh, Lincoln, and Woodbury. I know, what's they the problem? They stole my damn dollars. He won't fix my taco. I'm going to have a rush in it. He's holding my dollars 10 cents. Hold on, hold on, slow down. What's going on? Hello? What did I say? I, I can't tell. You, you're yelling at me. I need assistance. Now. I want my dollar or my taco. You're having a problem with the taco? The owner, the proprietor here. You having a problem with the talk? I am. The owner, bitch. Pardon me. Excuse me? I am upset. I know. You have to calm down and kind of tell me what's going on here now. If you don't listen to any goddamn thing I'm saying. Are you drunk? No, I am not a drunk. Okay, then why don't you just start, start you talking a little bit. You want me to you get some motherfucking ass over here. If I slow down. Down. I need some information from you, so slow down. You bring your ass and get my motherfucking dog my, out of here. My ass is staying in the, in the office here. You're so not coming? You need to... You, you need to, to, to me? You need to calm down and tell me something here. Okay? All right, bitch. What, what, was, wrong, what was wrong with the taco? The motherfucker refused to sell it to me. He refused to sell you a taco? He won't get my money back. He took your money, but he won't yeah, get a taco. Yeah, my goddamn house is locked up, you motherfucking you. I got one dollar seventy-five cents. Me? Why are you calling me names? Look, are you coming or not? As I far as I'm dollar. concerned, you can I have want that my taco. Damn dollar. What? I said, as far as I'm concerned, you can have the taco. Tell that bitch over here. I, how am I gonna get to this level? Get my money. Okay. What's your name? Antoinette. Antoinette. Yeah. Okay. What's your last name, Antoinette? Jones. Antoinette Jones. Mm -hmm. I want my dollar and my taco. And he, 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 he took your life. money, but he wouldn't give you your food. That's correct. That's not right. What's your day of birth? I don't, have to say, oh, I don't have to give you all that to come get my dollar. Well, I'm upset. You don't have to do anything if you don't want. Well, God damn it, that's just me. Calm down. I'm trying to get you the info from you. You're you eating, aren't you? I have to go live streaming. This motherfucker's insulting me, and you are too. Antoinette? Yes. Are you going to give me the information, or you just want to yell at me? I'm just saying what the fuck. 
You better come here and get my doll out this basket. Or else what? Look, you do you refuse to help me? No, I'm trying to get some information. What the fuck do you want? Where are you at right now? What did I say? Where did I say I was? I know, but where are you, you going to stay there or are you going to go to your house? Here. Don't come here no nigger. What? Don't bring no nigger here. Who's a nigger? Look, you, are you coming? Are you calling me a nigger? No, I said don't bring no nigger here. What, what does that have to do with this? You come here. Do you want? Are you I saying want you want job. a white deputy or what? How long? Are you saying you want a white deputy? Exactly. You don't want any no, uh, African American deputy? No, I don't. Why is that? Look. Nine one one, police, fire, medical. Yeah, we got a problem here. My wife is struggling in her jacket, can't get it off. She's struggling in her jacket. In her jacket, jacket I want a nine one one up here immediately. Okay, what's well, is she not breathing or? She's all right. She just can't get her jacket off. Well, in case you're wondering, the fire department did show up, rescued the woman, and saved that jacket. Nine one. Do you need fire, medical, or police? Yeah, just police. And what's the problem? Um, we're out here at McDonald's. Which McDonald's? The one on TV Highway. Okay, and we're on TV Highway. It's on one one ninety eight in okay. TV Highway. So you're out. In, you're in Aloha then, right? Yeah. Okay, and what's the problem there? Um, this the lady. We ordered some food and we went home that our order wasn't in there. And my little brother is crying for his orange juice and stuff. And we came back with the receipt and everything. Hey, can we have our order? We paid for it. And she was like, oh, no, I can't do anything about it. And she was laughing at my brother-in-law because he ordered the food and he couldn't speak English right. And, and she's not even showing up in the window now. She said, she told us that she was going to call the cops and nobody has showed up. And that's why I called. And she was being rude. And, you know, we wasted gas. My dad came and everybody I want to somebody here. Let my dad say what my dad, my dad wants a cop over here. here so. I don't want to make a problem here. I don't put the money, you know. Okay. Okay. And, I, and send somebody What's your name? Ray. I'm sorry, what? Ray. R-A-Y. Ray, what's your last name? O-S-M-A-N. Spell it, please. O-S-M-A-N. Oh, oh, awesome. Okay. And, okay, what kind of car are you in there? We're on a, in the Chrysler 300. What color? Blue. We're in a parking lot. You just, what color is your car? Blue, ma'am. Okay. All right. We'll send them over there. Thank right. you. Uh huh. Bye bye. Soy la hablando de la policía. Police, fire, Mac, medical. Hello. Yeah. Good evening. Yeah. This is. Uh, I'm calling from the McDonald's. I just calling because they have a problem with some customers after they're sending after 
and they're they, doing what? The customers, uh, they complain uh, about their food and things like that, and uh, they now they they don't want to move, and they told me to call the police, and yeah, I'm working here at McDonald's in Aloha. I'm okay. one of the so managers. Wait, 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 wait. The customers are complaining about their food? Yeah, because we, we're supposed to be given the food, uh, their own food, and I make the order, and I told them that everything was correct after, and they got mad because they told me to give them more food. And uh, I told them that I can give any free food away, and they told me, started telling me about words and all that. And I told them, you know what, if you don't move from here, I'm going to call the police. And they told me, okay, go ahead and call the police, and because we're not going to move. And finally, they moved like uh, 30 minutes ago out of the drive through And uh, now they are up there standing, walking right by drive through knocking at the window, and uh, saying that uh, I don't know what else they want after. Uh, my name is Helen. Helen? Yes. And your last name? Velasquez. And phone number there? Uh, it's, uh, it's 503. Uh -huh. six, 649. Uh -huh. 7092. Okay. So did you give them the wrong food? No, we did it. No, we did it. They just, just complaining because I don't know if they want any free food or I don't know what's wrong with them, but uh, I know I'm 100% sure that we're giving the correct food. And you told them to leave and they won't? Yes. All right. All right. Well, we'll be out there shortly. Okay. Come back you. if anything else delays. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.